Alright, so if you're getting a P0335 code, that means the ECM isn't getting a proper signal from the crankshaft position sensor, specifically sensor A. Now real quick, the crankshaft position sensor is what tells the engine computer exactly where the crank is, so it knows when to fire the spark and inject fuel. Super important, if it doesn't work right, the engine might crank but not start, or it might run rough, stall or misfire. The sensor is usually located near the bottom of the engine, either right by the crank pulley, the timing cover, or sometimes down by the transmission bell housing, depending on the vehicle. Now, if you don't have a scan tool, AutoZone or O'Reilly will usually let you borrow one for free. Just walk in and ask. If you do have a scanner with the live data, you might see that the RPM signal isn't reading right when cranking, or it's totally dead. That's a big clue the crank sensor isn't working. Here's what to check. First, inspect the wiring going to the sensor. Since it's down low on the engine, it's exposed to heat, oil, and road grime. Look for any damaged wires, broken plugs, or corrosion on the connector. Give it a wiggle. If the engine stumbles or the code goes away and comes back, it might be a loose connection. Next, if the wiring looks good, consider replacing the sensor itself. These do fail over time, especially on higher mileage cars. It's usually held in with one bolt and not too bad to get to. Might need to jack the car up depending on your setup. Also, check your engine grounds and battery voltage. Low voltage or bad grounds can cause sensor signals to drop out. That will throw this code too. And on some vehicles, a bad reluctor ring that's the little toothed wheel the sensor reads, can also be the issue. Like if it's cracked or out of place. That's more rare but possible, especially if you've had internal engine work done. So, yeah, check the wiring, check the sensor itself, make sure you're getting a good crank signal, clear the code and see if it comes back. That's it for this one, I'll catch you in the next.